Alfonso with Christian Alfonso and Peter Ruckel. Whereas Bo Brady and Hope Williams have consented together in holy wedlock and have witnessed same before God and this company, and there too have given and pledged their troth to one another and have declared the same by the giving of rings and the joining of hands, I now pronounce that they are husband and wife. Mr. Brady, you may kiss your bride. Yeah, the Get marry you right there. <laughs> The world was first introduced to Bo and Hope on Days of Our Lives back in 1983. They quickly, of course, became the super couple of soap operas. And now the iconic couple is returning this summer for the spin-off series Days of Our Lives Beyond Salem. Please welcome Christian Alfonso and Peter Reckle. Hi, guys. So cool to look back on oh that clip. Gosh. And Christian, I overheard you saying that that wedding dress was like $30,000 back in the 80s. Back that in 80s, six or seven, not sure which one, um... It was it was thirty thousand dollars, and wow. and Lee Smith was the costume designer at the time, and they flew him to Paris to pick up the, the silk tooling to make that dress, and the headpiece was all handmade and beaded, and it was incredible. We actually shot these scenes at the church here on Highland, and yeah. then shot all of the exteriors in London. Look at all that Very hair, clever. the beard, and the stash. Yeah, you know, we were competing. You have the most hair. Yeah. Look at you. And you got the Pope to marry you. I yeah. love it. I love him. Well, Bo and Hope, when you think about it, changed the face of soap operas and what we were looking for. Do you guys remember your first meeting or impression of one another? Mm. I was... Go, go ahead. You go first. You go first. It was fun because... Um, I was very green, and he was the experienced one. And I was just like, oh, they sing, find the light. I'm like, oh, which light? There's 5,000 lights. And he's like, probably, he never said it, but he was probably annoyed, thinking, oh, why do I get the new No, girl? no, no. <laughs> it was um, fun because it was, we had this camaraderie mm -hmm. that, hey, just play. Oh, yeah. And, you know, we, I think that's why it worked. So there was just the, this but innocence yeah. that came sure, across that, that you know. We don't have any more. No innocence. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll see about that next week. Yeah. But Hope almost lost Bo. And the irony is, y'all are back on this show, but Bo's dead. Or you, he, last we saw you, you died in Hope's arms. Yep. Hope needed to move on and really didn't have closure with True. Bo and Hope. And so I showed up in your dream or whatever. Yes, I called it the Scrooge episode. <laughs> Um, because he kind of, the character Shoulder. brought hope through. Through all the history that's oh, going on yes. here. And oh, why God. it was time to move on and their love would always be. Um, <clears throat> and here we are today. Ooh, did you talk tease. before this to agree together to come on? No. Today no. is the first time we've, well, we texted a little bit before. Yeah. First time saying. you've seen each other today, right yes. now. Yeah. Oh, wow. How yeah. does it feel? <laughs> Amazing. It's, it's, it's great. It's just like, you know. It's been what seven it's, years? It's six been years, almost something. seven. It's been almost seven it's like years. Like the old friend that you, you know, sure, you don't like, right, you know, right. Yeah, yeah, you don't need so, to catch up. What can we expect now? I came back to the show for just a couple shows as a ghost to save my. I don't. Is that aired yet? I don't think, I don't so. think oh. so. Anyway, <laughs> to help out <laughs> the help. family. Yes, yes. And uh, and at that time is when they introduced. You know, he, they came to me and said, "Hey, this is what we're thinking," and mm -hmm. it's just like you know, they cranked it up. Daytime is so much fun, and then you crank it up and do something like this. Yeah. You got a lot of story in five shows. And it's incredible. And I, the only way to really too. describe it is I know sometimes they say soap operas kind of go slow and you can, you can miss a few days. You can't blink. Not on this for one. For a second. It's going to drop July 11th. Okay, good. And the five shows after that, or the four shows after that, but. Seriously, if you blink, you will have to rewind it and watch again. Okay. Because yeah. going so much can, is happening. Right? Yeah. Yes, <laughs> which is great. Speaking of fans, we have one of your very loyal yeah. fans here today. She's been watching the show since she was 15 years old. Has no idea. There she is. She's about to meet you. She's getting ready right oh. now. She thinks she's here to play Bow and Hope trivia. So, guys, I okay. think she would win. I bet she would, too. <laughs> Absolutely. She would what are your fans win. called, Bopes? Boat fans. Boat fans. She's a boat. Well, she's, she's the queen boat. The queen boat. <laughs> so, guys, we're going to hide you behind over here, and we're going to bring her out, and y'all are going to pop up behind those things. Okay. Are you up for it? Uh, uh, of course. Okay. When do we pop up? We'll tell you. We'll so you guys go hide out. behind that, and we'll bring her out. Okay. okay. Awesome. Okay. So let's make sure they're hidden. Let's get her hidden I back there. Think All right. Come on out, Shannon. There Hi. she is. Come on out. Come on out, Shannon. Hi. Hi. How are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm good, how are you? 
you right, too. Ken, yes. So let's face this way so everybody can see you. Are you ready for a little trivia? Yes. Before we get to the trivia, though, on a scale of one to ten, how big of a of a boat fan are you? Oh, a hundred. Wow. <laughs> what do you love about them? They, you know what? They just had the best chemistry, you know, and it, they really made you feel like like they were a real couple. And I don't know. It was just they, they really drew you in. Um, I remember being 15, <laughs> homesick from school, and it was actually Thanksgiving break, and flipping through the channels, came across them, and... Have you ever missed an history. episode? No. Never. Wow. You're going to kill this trivia game, then. Are you uh, ready to find out who we're playing against? Yes. Okay, All right, contestants, come on out. Contestants, come on out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my gosh. Oh, so nice to see you as well. Let's all have a seat. Let's all have a seat. Uh, you are sit. Sit right there, right here. Oh. Let me just grab my glasses. Thank um, you. I, I thought you were going to tackle them. Okay. <laughs> are you, are you are surprised? You, I didn't want to be a stalker. <laughs> <laughs> are you still feeling surprised? How are you feeling? I, uh, I, <laughs> I've never been speechless, and I'm, very, I'm, I'm almost speechless, you guys. Oh, what do you want to say to them? What do they mean to you? I, like, I don't even know how to put it into words, but I don't know. Something about you guys just... I, I, I can't still can't watch, like, your dying scenes. Like, look what I'm gonna get. I will literally... I get the whole ugly cry thing. I do, too. You do? Oh. You've seen me. You've seen me. You've seen you ugly yes. cry. Oh, you more times than you know. Yeah. Never missed an episode since 15. Wow. Tell us your favorite. Is it, like, New Orleans or London or which one? That That's so hard... Okay, it's a toss-up, but yes, probably New Orleans mm -hmm. to yeah. start it out. Right. That was, we had <laughs> so much top, fun yeah. there. Oh yeah. my goodness! We I did so much there. Yeah, we Actually, did. Actually, some of the storyline from. Yes. Boom. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. Ah, I <laughs> we love won't it. Miss it.